everybody, it's Gregorio from Tokyo coming at you again. And this time I'm doing a little old school. I'm going back to some of the food tasting that I used to do when it came to the cup noodles and the limited edition stuff. Uh, I don't know if you've seen my other videos, but I used to do a lot of like uh, the limited edition or just the brand new flavors of cup noodles. And, you know, there is uh, this one, Tom Young, which uh, maybe you've seen, but uh, maybe not. This one has been around for a while, Chili Tomato. And this one is a new one. This one is a Karage. Karage. Now, I don't know if you just noticed the size differences in these. Here's a regular size cup noodle. There's a super mini one, but this is a regular size cup noodle. This is a big size, which I've had before. I've had a big size cup noodle. But. This is the first time that I am going to try the king size cup noodle. That's like, I don't know, in terms of width, height is not that much, but width is much more. So I'm going to say double the amount of noodles, the size of my head, compared to this one. What is it? What do you say? Is this like a good accessory right there? I don't know. I don't know. But I'm going to try out this. And I don't know if you realize karage usually it's not spelled in katakana but karage is usually like fried chicken or anything that means it's like a fried item so karage and down here it says uh black pepper shoyu aji so it's black pepper and soy sauce flavored and there is a picture at the top that shows chunks of some type of meat along with corn it could be tomatoes or red peppers and green peppers. And the yellow stuff is probably freeze-dried uh, eggs. And it's going to be with probably the, the, the shoyu soy sauce soup. Now, what type of meat is it? I'm not quite sure, but let's try it out. Now it's three minutes, the recommended time for the the noodles to soak up the hot water now again i'm i'm telling you how this was the regular size and now this is the king size now this is a ton of soup i don't know if i'm gonna drink all of this soup because it's all it's soy sauce and so that's a lot of salt so i might stick to just eating the noodles which again is not even that healthy either but i like tasting the new flavors that they put out now again this is the Karage, fried chicken, and I don't know if you can see here, I don't want to spill it, but see it looks like little pieces of fried chicken. It doesn't look anything like the photo. This looks like slices of meat. This is little pieces of fried chicken. So let's stir it up and taste it. So actually, let me get a piece of the fried chicken just to taste how the chicken is by itself. It tastes like fried chicken that has gone really soggy. So of course there's no crispiness, but it does taste kind of like the breaded fried chicken. And you might find at KFC. So let's taste this. This is supposed to be the pepper and soy sauce based uh, flavor with the fried chicken. And I'm sure I'm gonna scald my tongue because I easily burn it. And if you don't know, here's your Japanese word of the day, neko jita, neko jita. Nekojita is uh, burning your tongue. And Nekojita literally means cat's tongue. Cat's tongue. <sighs> Let's go. Itadakimasu. It's hot. Um, surprisingly, it's not a strong flavor. It's actually quite light compared to, I guess, the regular soup that it usually has. Usually the regular soup and the regular cup noodles is stronger, but the taste is much lighter, surprisingly for it being shoyu and black pepper. And here's the freeze dries egg. Not so great, not so bad, but as I burn, my lips 
Another thing is it's a little oilier than usual. I guess it's from the fried chicken. The fried chicken probably is giving off the oil that it was fried in. Usually the noodles are just more like in the soup. It doesn't feel like uh, oil, but you can feel on your lips, there's this kind of like oily taste. Not oily taste, oily texture. So mm, that's kind of the negative point on this. But overall, I'd say pick it up, give it a try. It's tasty, but it's just got that uh, oil taste, the oil feeling that you get on your lips after you eat it. So if you're gonna be in Japan and you wanna pick up this fried chicken cup noodles, king size, I didn't see any other version except king size. So pick it up, try it, and tell me what you think. Any comments or questions, leave them in the box below. Please subscribe, share, rate the video. I appreciate anything that you leave. Of course, I don't care for a thumbs down. And of course, I don't care for negative comments. But if you're going to leave them, whatever. Say la vie. Anyways, Gregorio from Tokyo. I'll check you all later. Peace.